uh, this neighborhood is called Omdiep. It actually means in English undeep, not deep. And I really don't know why. It doesn't have anything to do with the name. In 2004, uh, when I graduated from the Art Academy, I was still living in a student room and I wanted to move to a house, so I tried to find a house and I already knew that I wanted to live in this area or in a similar kind of area. Well, this neighborhood was built, uh, I think, in the 40s, maybe a little bit earlier, 30s. And uh, um, originally, it's, it's really a working class neighborhood. So, social housing, small, cheap. It must have changed in the 70s or 80s. And uh, a lot of criminal activities and uh, became a really bad area. And so now it's listed on the list of worst areas in in uh, the Netherlands. We have a list of 40 districts. Um, and I decided I want to live there uh, just to see it in the middle. And uh, also because I thought like maybe I can do a project over there. So I started this, the, these photos, this documentary already in 2004, 2005. At a certain point I realized that uh, my neighbors were actually very typical people for this neighborhood. On the one side, I have a neighbor, his name is Willem. He's a very nice, friendly uh, man, uh, working already for uh, almost 40 years in a plastic factory. On the other hand, left side over there, uh, lives Kit. And Kit is also a typical person for this area, but he always has money problems. He often has bigger problems that he has to go to jail for a few days, then they send him away again. These two persons were, are actually typical for this neighborhood. And I like them very much from the beginning. So I started to become friends with them. Uh, with Willem I often drink tea and with Kit I often go to see when he feeds his snakes. So uh, I kept on, at a certain point in 2006, something like that, I started to make photos of them and kept on, kept on following them, in particular them. So uh, I come from a very conservative background and I think, I mean, many people are a little bit afraid going here. In my opinion, if you only think this is a very antisocial neighborhood, then you only judge that from other people who tell you. And I try to live in it and to show that there are many good sides also from uh, all the people living here. So it's again about these prejudice, which is an important theme. I mean, I really think this is a brilliant and very nice neighborhood with very, very nice people in it.